Thank you for holding. This is Nick speaking. How may I help you? Nick, how you doing? Good. How are you? Doing well, thank you. Are you the Are you the manager? Uh, I am not the manager. Uh, I am a floor manager for the restaurant, but not the uh, on duty manager. No uh, problem. Do you want to speak to the on duty? Or? Uh, is the uh, is the head chef around? I know he's uh, from the booth. I just want to talk to him about some of the menu options. Oh, the menu options? I can definitely help you out with that. Sure, I, I I saw your uh, your commercial last year about uh, everything being one hundred percent authentic Italian and uh, big fan of your food. That's for sure. And you were wondering what? Sorry, cut out a little bit. Oh, I I was wondering about the chicken Alfredo. Uh, I was I was in Naples uh, in Italy a couple of years ago and I couldn't find any chicken Alfredo. What what part of Italy is the Alfredo from? Uh, we actually make the Alfredo uh, here in house. Oh, you do. Okay. Mm-hmm. What about the uh, five cheese Eddie Al Forno? The five cheese Eddie Al Forno, so that is just our um, ziti noodles, and then it's uh, a five cheese marinara blend. So it's marinara sauce blended with five different cheeses. You have like uh, Parmesan, mozzarella, um, ricotta, fontina, and um, oh god, the fifth, uh, the fifth one, fontabella. Um, so it's those five cheeses all blended together with a marinara sauce, and then we also put some more cheese baked on top of that. Good shit. Yeah. And then the Al Forno is just the baking style. It's just baked in a oven. Like, yeah, in the oven, uh, Al Forno. Cheese is coated on top. Yeah. Sure. 4,800 calories. Must be pretty damn good. Yeah, yeah, it is. <laughs> what part of Italy is the uh, five cheese Gito Al Forno from? Uh, that, that stuff's not from Italy. None of our stuff we actually import from Italy. Most of it's made in-house. Uh, it's just authentic Italian recipes that we have. Holy shit. I was under the impression everything was imported from Italy from the commercial that I saw. Oh, get gotcha. No, I'm sorry if you were under that assumption. No, it's just all the recipes we have are. Um, however, none of the actual food that we have is. Interesting. So the the shrimp scampi, uh, when you say an authentic recipe, what uh, mm-hmm. what part of Italy is the scampi from, the recipe? Uh, the recipe itself, it's just a traditional Italian recipe. There's no like specific part that like we take it from. Tuscany, or Naples, like, maybe Sicily? Yeah, it'd be more like a Tuscany thing. Tuscany thing, okay, interesting. Good to know, alright, well I appreciate your time and uh, I gotta get on the treadmill before I eat some of this food. Calories are up to 6,000 on some of these damn things. <laughs> yeah, Holy yeah. shit. <laughs> It's all the cheese. It all gets loaded on there and then gets stuck in you. Yeah. Well, I'm lactose intolerant, so what are you going to do? Uh, for the cheese stuff? I mean, we can always remove the cheese from most of our dishes for you. Interesting. Maybe if instead of the five cheese Eddie Al Forno, you could do like a two cheese Eddie Al Forno. <laughs> yeah, we could. We could do that. Good to know. I'll think about it. Thank you very much for your time. Yeah, of course. You have a great rest of your day. Have a good day. How the fuck are you doing? Two cheese, you need a phone or still got.